All right, motherfuckers, we starting off today. We got Garacio right there. Say hey, hey, Garacio. No, nope. strong hand, homie. Okay. We got Jelly, Stinky. All right. Update with the Rigo. Uh, Summit's gonna send a new CDI box with the new coil with the new uh, Dizzy. It's on its way. It gets here Tuesday. So this one's going to put get pushed over here. Me and Orasha and Danny going to finish whatever fucking Freddy. Fucking motherfuckers missing in action. Didn't finish on that. So we can uh, start uh, prepping it for Raptor, Raptor Liner. Prep the front for uh, body work. But the most important is getting everything prepped for whatever it needs to be. So it can stop killing time. Uh, so we can made it back to the frame like that. There's no many to that many cars in here. it will be one, two, but this motherfucker should be uh, here Tuesday. So next weekend we should be installing the new, uh, hyper spark system back into it, finishing the whole wall. But I'm going to make sure this time we started up how we did it like this without, you know, putting everything back together and, uh, hoping that motherfucker works. Uh, but yeah, shout out to, uh, Holly and fucking Summit. They looked out for us. Instead of waiting for them to repair it, they just, uh, sent us a new system. And Holly and Summit's gonna take, figure that shit out. And they're gonna send it for repairs and have it as a, as a refurbished unit. All right. So now we're just gonna jump on to that. And later on, me and Horacio gonna make a uh engine stand the thing is we have a lot of engines that need to be started before they go into cars so we're just gonna make a run in that thing they call it in a run engine stand or engine run stand something like that but we're gonna make one we have a lot of metal back here that we can make out of pieces we have an extra engine jet engine stand and we got fat boy engine that needs to be oh that shit don't even have an oil pan we figured that shit out. We figured it out. If not, we got another 6 all right there, fully completed, that uh, we can make it start. But I wanted to use Fat Boy Engine, but he doesn't have an oil pan ready for it. So we just probably use the, the 6 all right there. But that motherfucker is attached to a big ass transmission because it's an all wheel drive transmission. Hmm. We can use the old Betty motor to start. Huh. We figure it out. We gonna figure it out because we have a bones motor, but it's attached to a fucking engine too. This is the one I wanted to start, but that motherfucker don't have an oil pan. But we can jack the oil pan off the fucking six point two. But it's attached to a trans dimension too. So we figured it out. We just need an engine for now to mock up. So we probably use this one to mock up and then pull that one, bring it forward, and we start that one up. But meanwhile, me and Orasi are going to get to this. We're going to take all that nasty rust back off of it and starts, uh, start, um, finish whatever Freddy needs to finish and finish. Uh, prepping. I hope we've done prepping by two and we can get to the engine stand today. If not, we didn't make the engine stand. All right. All right. We're bringing it in. It's not the finished product. I just ran out of primer. Right now it's just scuff, primer, scuff, primer, scuff. You What you want to do is build up. So you will see this. You want to build up so they can match up. Right here is ugly, but uh, I don't think it's gonna get any better than that. I'm just gonna throw a little bit of bondo in there, see if we can cover it up. That's about it. And just we just gotta get rid of these lines that the fucking flappy left behind. It was hard to get in there with the fucking shit. Other than that, this one has got kind of disappeared, but not super disappeared. But this gonna be. Wheel wheel goes here. You rarely see this piece, and it has the motor going this way. 
or the, I think it goes this way. So you won't see this piece. They're just cleaning up here. Uh, it's gonna have a vintage air, but I don't know when. So we're not gonna really touch that. It's gonna get painted with the car, but not painted with the shit, but it's not really gonna have any body work to it. So we don't care about that. That we left it alone because you don't see it. The wheel well again goes over it. Uh, it's mostly this area. It's what you get to see. The booster goes here. So you rarely see this piece right here. It's just this item right here. That's what we worry about. And it's not a show car, so I really don't care. Out of this, uh, everything is already primered. It's primer over there is where I took the foam out of it. You can see the big old gaps and these gaps didn't match with the floorboard, the back one. But it is tagged and it is tagged from the bottom up. So we bend the metal to try to create a seal. Then we put the foam seal on it. So now it's a, a full seal there. The thing is that we should have took this side and go all the way over here. We were losing these. We had to take them off and put them back on, but I don't think I didn't think it had this hump. No, it it was a flat piece. It didn't have this hump, the this metal. So that's why we stopped at the hump before the hump. I just gotta put the drain plugs in there. Right now they're looking for the seam sealer so I can seam it. We're just gonna seam this area. Let's see how you see daylight right there. We're gonna seam it, this piece all the way around. We're going to seam seal everything on top. And then in the bottom, it's going to get another layer of seam sealer. Uh, it's going to get kill mat from the back all the way up. And then we can start wiring it. But uh, Freddy still has to finish right here. You see the air, the, the light right there? I remember I was telling you it was blowing through. You can see those holes. This, this metal is super weak compared to the new metal. So it would just blowing through so freddie had to come in the inside and weld that shit that he stitched it so he has to do the same shit on this side so we're just gonna seam seal through all the way to here let him figure that shit out but we're gonna full seam seal the other side because that one's done and then next sunday once he finished we seam seal the bottom and probably by next next sunday it gets raptor Wrapped, it gets primer, raptor, and it goes on to the frame. So other than that, or else you'll find the seam sealer. This seam sealer goes brushed on. Uh, we didn't get the, you know, the one that used the cock gun. No. Uh, I like that brush on better because you can use the brush and st stuff that motherfucker everywhere. It kind of it looks it imitates that right there. So factory shit. Let me use the brush. Other than that, we should be there today, and that's it from that. Once I uh, finish here, we move on to the making that engine stamp. But that's a whole different video. All right, bringing it back. Seam sealer is in. Super thick. See how thick it is? That's just one layer of it. I'm gonna do a second layer, but we're gonna let this dry and it's gonna have another layer in the bottom. But that's it. That's gonna be the end of this video. Uh, we bring it back in for this car for next Sunday. Freddy has to finish there. That's why I left him that big old gap. So he can finish comfortable and he don't have to take shit off. He just gotta finish it. Uh, I got to see for those if we use the old ones or see if they sell some brand new ones and that have to go seam sealed too. Those uh, fucking uh, is, is drains for the for the floor plan. Uh, other than that, it's done over here. We still need layers, but we need primer. Uh, again, Freddie has to come and finish this off. All uh, that, those holes right there, that, 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 that. He has to finish this. So, we get back to that. I'm gonna give me a little small block just to block this. We're not worried about none of that. It's just whatever you see. Other than that, and she's done. We're bringing it back next week for this one. 
So this is the end of this video.